Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Welcome to the first Sunday in the month of November. Amen. This month shall be glorious for you, for your family. It is a month of miracles. November is a month of miracles. And that miracle from God will begin to manifest in your life. It has already started. Amen. And throughout this month of November, even to the very last day of this year, 2022, you are going to receive tremendous impact from God, miraculous touches, things that will carry you from where you are to a place of glory. Everything that is impossible for you, God is going to make possible in the name of Jesus. This is our month of miracles. And this morning, I'm excited to welcome you to Morning Dew Prayers. In this very first Sunday of the month of November, God will arise for you, arise for your family. It will bless you. It will uphold you. It will turn things around in your favor. And you will begin to rejoice. Where you have been crying, where you have been rejected, where things have been tough for you, because it's a month of miracle. The miracle that you need for your water to turn to wine. God is going to do it for you in this very season in the name of Jesus. Everyone that has been laughing at you, that has been mocking you and asking you questions. Where is your God? They will see your God in action. Because the things that are impossible for man, those are the things that are possible with God. And God is going to show himself that indeed... He is the God of all flesh. And there's absolutely nothing impossible for him to do. Nothing is too hard for God. And for your own situation concerning you, your family, and all your loved ones, there's going to be a tremendous impact from the Most High God in this month of miracles in the mighty name of Jesus. So I want you to rejoice. I want you to celebrate. I want you to be expectant. I want you to have a heart that is ready to receive the things that God is prepared to do for you in this season. And it will not pass you by. It will not elude you. You will not be at the wrong place at the right time. You will be ready when God comes your way to open every shut door of glory that has been shut against you in the mighty name of Jesus. The Bible tells us in Isaiah chapter 12, verse 4 and 5, it says, And in that day you will say, Praise the Lord. Call upon his name, declare his deeds among the people. Make mention that his name is exalted. Amen. Sing to the Lord, for he has done excellent things. This is known in all the earth. Today is a Thanksgiving Sunday. It's a day to thank God. It's a day to celebrate. It's a day to sing praise to God. It's a day to exalt his holy name. Why are you doing this? Because of the miracles he has already started to do. That you are alive even this morning to see this video, to pray along with us. It's because God has done a miracle for you. And let, let me tell you, if the enemy had his way, he wouldn't even allow you to see a new day. But God has done a miracle. And there are many, many more specific, purposeful, time-bound miracles that God is bringing your way in this month of miracle in the mighty name of Jesus. So today... It's a day that we're going to say, praise the Lord. We're going to exalt his name in rejoicing, in jubilation, in celebration for the things that he alone can do and will do and is going to do in your life, your destiny, your family, your business, your education, over everything that concerns you in the mighty name of Jesus. That which the Lord will do for you in this season of miracles. Everybody will see it. They will give praise to God. It will be known all over. Your friends will know it. Your neighbors will see it. Your, your, your colleagues will know it. Your family members will rejoice with you. Even your enemies, they will wonder what has transpired in the life of this fellow. And that will be your testimony in the name of Jesus. So I pray for you today that everything that will cause you to praise the Lord. Amen. God will do in a miraculous way in your life and in your family. The things that have not allowed you to say, thank you, Father. The things that have made your mouth to be shut in the area of praising God and exalting his name for great and mighty things, God will show up for you. It will do a miracle in your life. It will do a miracle in your family. And everybody will see it. They will come and rejoice with you. They will celebrate with you. 
they will say indeed God has been good to you because you are going to be a recipient of his miracles in this season, in this month of November, before this year will run out, God will show up for you in the mighty name of Jesus. You see, the very first time that Jesus came and started his ministry, it was recorded in John chapter 2, when you read from verse 1 all the way down to 11. He was invited to a wedding in the land of Cana of Galilee. And right there, the couples were in a situation that shame was about to come. And the very first thing that Jesus did was a miracle. He turned water into wine. He saved a situation, a situation of shame that was about to, to, to be better. It was looming. Shame was already coming. But he intervened and turned it into glory. And there was, there was a miracle. There was joy. There was celebration. There was exaltation. In fact, the couples, they were the talk of the town. I am praying for you today, this season, even in this month, before your shame will manifest. God will locate you. He will perform a miracle, turn every looming shame into glory, and you will be highly promoted. You will be highly exalted. You will be highly celebrated in the name of Jesus Christ. God will show forth for you in this month of miracle. It's only God that can perform a miracle. You can't do it on your own. There is no way. All that we're going to do, that we're going to be expectant. And I'm praying for you, all your expectations, even if it looks as if it's impossible, very good. That is what God can do. The Bible tells us that what is not possible with man, that is what is possible with him. Amen? And I'm praying for you, every of your expectations, that is beyond your reach, beyond your capacity, beyond your 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 beyond your grabs god will show up for you it will bring those things into manifestation and you will be a recipient of a miracle in the name of jesus christ so today i pray that the thing that needs to happen in your life in your family in your business concerning your health your finance your your projects your your company where you're working your career concerning your children your husband your wife your 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 parents concerning your siblings your neighbors your friends your colleagues your business partners all those things that you are expecting that are beyond your capacity god will locate you he will perform a miracle for you and you will rejoice forevermore in the mighty name of jesus i pray for you as the year begins to wind down because we're in the last season of the year we are just few months to go okay i will begin to call it weeks god will show up for you the things that you thought is already over the things that you have concluded that it cannot be done anymore god will perform a miracle in those areas and you will begin to rejoice in the mighty name of jesus luke chapter 18 verse 27 luke 18 verse 27 jesus said the things that are impossible with men are possible with god i'm praying for you in this season of miracles, every impossibility in your life will turn around to become a miracle in the name of Jesus. Pos impossibility of barrenness is turning around. Impossibility of promotion is turning around. Impossibility of greatness is turning around. Impossibility of healing is turning around. Impossibility of enlargement is turning around. Impossibility of giving birth is turning around. God will perform a miracle in your life and you will rejoice in the name of Jesus. I'm praying for you concerning those things that are impossible for you. God will show up for you. It will arise for you. It will locate you and it will cause a miracle to be wrought in your life such that everybody will know that indeed God has favored you in the mighty name of Jesus. So I want to congratulate you because I know that this is your season of a turnaround. This is the season you have been waiting for. This is the time and season that God has prepared to showcase you to the world in a miraculous way. Barriers, limitations, obstacles are going to be brought down for your sake. And in a miraculous manner, you are going to become the talk of the town in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to elevate you. It will carry you with his mighty hands. It will protect you, establish you. It will cause all that he has proposed for you to manifest. 
and no longer will you be barren, no longer will you be fruitless, no longer will you mourn, no longer will you sorrow, but joy will come your way in the name of Jesus. So I pray for you today that this beginning, the first Sunday in this month of November, you are going to rejoice forevermore because of the miraculous touch that God is bringing your way in the mighty name of Jesus. The word of God also tells us in 1 Corinthians chapter 2 and verse 9, it says, but it is written, eyes have not seen, nor ear heard, nor has it entered into the heart of man, the things which God has prepared for those who love him. This is a season of miracle. The miracle that God has prepared for you, eyes have not seen it. The miracle that's going to come your way, ears have not heard it. The miracle that God's going to do for you, it has not even entered into the heart of man. It is fresh. It is glorious. It is novel. It's innovative. It's barrier breaking. It's tongue talking. It's mouth dropping. It's joy uplifting. In the name of Jesus. Your miracle is fresh from God. It's coming your way. You are unstoppable. Nothing will hinder it in the name of Jesus. I pray for you today. All that God has proposed for you to take you to a level that you cannot even imagine in your business, in your career, in your ministry, concerning your family, it will manifest in this month of miracles in the name of Jesus. The miracle that you need for everyone to know that God has touched you in this season is coming your way in the mighty name of Jesus. So I welcome you again to the month of miracles. Your miracle will be established. Your miracle will come to you. All your expectations will turn around to become manifestations because of the power of the touch of God. Miraculous hand of God is going to carry you to your place of joy, glory, promotion in the name of Jesus Christ. This is your season to rejoice. Everywhere that you have been forgotten, this is the time that you will be remembered for good, for promotion in the name of of Jesus Christ. God is taking you to higher grounds because his miracle will break barriers for your sake, for your family in the mighty name of Jesus. Where they have written you off, God is turning everything around miraculously, suddenly, speedily and it will be in your favor in the mighty name of Jesus. So I declare the miracle of God upon you. You'll be recipients of God's miracle. The miracle that you need for everything to turn around to joy is his release upon you in this season in the mighty name of Jesus. So I invite you to go on and begin to praise the Lord. You don't need to wait. Just believe because it says if you only believe, you will see the glory of God. Every glory that carries a miracle in your life, in your family, you will see it. It will manifest in this season. In the mighty name of Jesus. And great shall be your testimonies in the name of Jesus. This week is a week of miracles. This month is a month of miracles. Miracles upon miracles. The things that you cannot do. The things that you're not qualified for. The things that are beyond your capacity. It will manifest in your, in your favor. It will begin to happen because God has released angels on assignment to perform tremendous miracles for you. In the name of Jesus. So I declare unto you that as you step out right from today, you begin to receive miracles. Miracles will connect with you in your going out and your coming in. In your home, in your household, in whatever you do for a living, in your livelihood, in your economy. A miracle is coming your way this season in the name of Jesus. I release the blessing of God upon you. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. You are unstoppable. You will not go under. You are being promoted. You are being elevated. Because there is a miracle that God has released unto you. In the name of Jesus. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen, amen, and amen. I release God's blessing and miracles all throughout this week. In the name of Jesus, wherever you step your feet, because you are carrying the hand and because the hand of God is carrying you, you will receive a miracle in the mighty name of Jesus. Your testimonies shall be so plenty. It shall be glorious. It shall be mouth dropping. 
It shall be, it shall be beyond the capacity of man because God is going to show you that according to Jeremiah 32 verse 27, that he is the God of our flesh and there is nothing too hard for him to do. He will do it for you and everyone will come and rejoice with you because indeed it is your season of a miracle. Congratulations. God bless you. You will enjoy your miracle. It will last forever and your smiles, your rejoicing will be permanent in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless you. Have a glorious Sunday and a fulfilled, miraculous week ahead in the name of Jesus. Shalom.